Hello there, it is I, the Geordie Nerd, and I am back again with another episode of Trailer Park Boys Season 6, Episode 4. That big thing behind us needs to disappear. There we go. Fucking magic. You saw that first hand, eh? Anyway, um, yeah, sorry about the wait. Um, Season 6, Episode 2, they just do not want us to get that out. So, in this episode, the link will be available for the full, unedited reaction for free for you all so if you want to watch this then go watch that or vice versa do it anyway uh let's just get in this now and have some fun <laughs> anyway i slept there had a pretty good sleep but i still had to get up early this morning because i got responsibles now I'm growed up i got kids a lot of people say you can't smoke dope and get drunk when you have kids and that's not true you can but you still gotta get up in the morning as long as you get up in the morning and do responsibles. Trinity has not been doing as well this year as she usually does. I had a chance to talk with her, her teacher. He's a nice man. He's, you know, attractive and. Which is what's important when your chil children are trying to get an education. Got to do a few things to help her out with the project and hand it in. And hopefully she'll get a pass in grade learning. And sure, I'm fucking hungover and I'm burnt out, but that's what being a good dad's all about. <laughs> well, I would hope so, cause recently, yeah, man. In pain, drink it away again. Do you know what I mean? That, no. Drink responsibly. Don't do that. That's that's stupid. Do you know what I mean? I'm saying a the therapist. They're helping. It's supposed to be helping. Anyway, how are you? How are you doing? Eh? <laughs> uh, trust Paul to make it bleak as always and just constantly ramble and talk about bullshit and nonsense in the intro. Don't worry, this isn't the episode. I'm not... Waffling during the episode. This is just the intro. This is the most I get to speak. You're welcome. All right, that's great. Pick him up anytime you want, tomorrow or the next day. <gasps> oh, the Pussy Love Center is a success. Bubbles, where in the fuck is Oscar Goldman? Not sure. Who in the fuck is Oscar Goldman? I didn't know it was going to cause such a big problem with Trinity School, but I just couldn't deal with it. I let him go for reasons I'd rather not discuss at this point. <laughs> Oh, he's poor chicken. Oscar Goldman is missing. Nobody knows where he is. How is that possible? You were taking care of him. I know, but he's an idiot. All he does is run around and peck at things, looking at insects, stick his little beak and gum, and drives me nuts. Ricky, he's a little chicken. You're a little chicken. <laughs> uh. Oscar Goldman got out. You gotta help me find him. Can you help me find him? Well, I've gotta get building supplies. I'm not trying to do up Ricky's shit right now. That's the thing, Julian. It's not about Ricky. Trinity needs Oscar Goldman today or she's gonna fail grade six. I didn't know. How'd he get loose? Not sure. <laughs> Don't worry, Bubbles. I won't say anything, mate. I've got your back. So, did you find your chicken yet? No, I can't find the fucking thing anywhere. You didn't see it, did you? No, but I've been thinking about thinking and I think I might even have an idea. Thinking about thinking. Right. Smart. I swear that was you, Randy, if I didn't have a t-shirt on. Yeah, holy shit, I just didn't realize that for a second. What's up, dude? That wasn't weird at all. Hurry the fuck up, Trevor! <laughs> fuck playing games, Trev. Fast, Ricky. Oh, Dippy! <laughs> you trying to tell me a chicken's fucking smarter than you, Trump? It's not smarter than me, but it might be tougher. Yeah, it might be tougher, like, to be fair. Did you know the deal, too? Over. Do oh, it, you stupid kid! Trevor, stop turtling! Fight back! What deal? You're my dad. Just help me out. Over. Fight back! Hit that woman, you coward! I'm a little doctor, I am. It's my doctor car right there. Get the fucking car, Trevor. I'm gonna call the cops! That's his dog shot call right there. Let's go, Trevor. You're gonna have to call the cops from the doctor! Don't have to call the cops, he's a doctor, clearly. Look at his doctor call. So, Ricky lost his daughter's science project. A grown man can't keep track of a chicken? That's pathetic. I keep a track of a chicken for you, my, my lady. <laughs> Don't even know what that means. I'll go down with Lucy. And pretend that you're Trinity's father? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, it works for me. Yeah. I wouldn't miss this for anything. I wouldn't miss you for anything, pretty lady. <laughs> Again, 
Don't know what that means. You ever been beat up by a girl, Ray? <sighs> no. Fuck! Jeez, Ricky, what the, what's the matter with you? What's going on? A snake just bit my fucking cock, Dad. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> The old snake dick. Come on, buddy. Let's come on out. You're not gonna die, buddy. But what if it's poisonous? Well, if it's poisonous, you're gonna get one, want to get somebody to suck the poison out of it right away. I've seen a lot of TV specials about snakes and snake bites, and that's what they always do. They suck the poison out. It's the most important thing you can do. You could be my best friend in the whole world, but nah, mate. You're dead. You're dead. I'm sorry, I can't do it. Out your arm, out your ass cheek. Fine. Leg, fine. Nah, you're dead. I think I'll tangle up his jugs and extension cords. Ray, maybe if you didn't have extension cords and jugs all over your place, this wouldn't have happened. Jesus Christ, nobody else gets mixed up in it. What the fuck are you doing, Trevor? Yeah, Trevor, you're the problem, mate. Not the piss jugs and extension cords left by this man at a dump. You. Seeing the chicken was in here? It was, Ray. All I can figure is that he either jumped it or he climbed up the gate here with his little clicker feet and <laughs> gnarled that off with his beak. That's what he did, right, Bubbles? I got your back. So what do you think? I don't. I think it's an inside job, boys. That's what I think. Oh, somebody let it out? That's exactly what I mean. Who the fuck would do that? I don't know, boys. No, Bubbles, I can tell you that 100%. Do you hear that? No, are you drunk? Yes. Listen. <laughs> Yes, he's very, very drunk. Oh, good, boys. I lost the trail. I need something to get me back on the scent. Oh, what could that be? Mm. More alcohol, perchance. Hey, guys, I found a mushroom that looks like a cock. <laughs> Trevor, can you please stop thinking about cocks for 10 seconds? He's got the fucking chicken. Yeah. Trevor, pull him out of here. Or just knock, right? Knock and ask nicely for the chicken back. I mean, if you had just asked where the chicken was, he would have told you, you lunatic. It was me that let the dirty little fucking chicken out. What do you mean, Bubbles? I didn't want to tell you because I was embarrassed. It happened when I was a little guy, Ricky. Me and some other kids were fucking around over at Mr. Johnson's farm. And he came out and chased us and we all ran and tried to jump the chicken coop and they all made it, but I slipped and went right through the fucking roof down into the coop. <laughs> they packed me unmercifully. <laughs> oh, poor Bubbles, man. It's just not on. How you doing? Ricky, Trinity's dad. Hello. We've met, of course. Lucy? Hi. We've met, of course, sexy mama. Is there any way you can get like a one day extension for this marking thing or? Absolutely not, no. The students have to respect the deadlines. I'm sorry, if I, if I don't have a chicken from Trinity, she fails science and unfortunately fails grade six. Sorry. That's not good. I had Julian fill in for you while you're checking out the chicken, so. All right, well anyway, may I present you with Oscar Goldman. I found him. I'm sorry, the deadline was this morning and she missed it. Deadline's a deadline. Oh, come on, dude. Don't be a dick. Like Oscar Goldman, look at him. That's a nice looking chicken right there. Just because her dad's a bit of a fuck up, pardon my language, in front of all these kids, doesn't mean she should fail grade six like her dad did. That's right, Ricky, you tell him. I mean, it's pathetic. I mean, come on. It, a couple hours late, and she's gonna fail grade six. All right, then. Okay, you passed. Congratulations. Well, thank you. And listen, if you. I'm growing a lot of dope. If you want some dope or something later, I really appreciate this, okay? Big time. Sure. Thanks. Oh my god, I can't believe you did it. Oh. oh my god, Sarah, I can't believe we did it. No. Oh. At school today, you are very, very, very responsible. Yeah? Yeah. Well, let's see. I can't do anything. A snake bit my cock. <laughs> you can still hook a girl up, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, exactly. You've still got your hands, Reed. Wow, um... Good episode, man. I'm glad they found the chicken in the end and, and uh, Trinity got our, our grade six. I mean, this just it's just a wacky show and that's what I love about it. Um, sorry about the wait. If you're still here and you're still listening to me waffle on, um, every single episode of season six is now on the Patreon. So yeah, definitely go check that out if you feel like it. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you all again soon for more Trailer Park Boys reaction videos.